much now since little brother got locked up but i'm stuck smoking this beer waiting for the weed man to get stocked up and my girl canceled on me said something else popped up and i can't get with my ex now because her ring finger while rocked up damn, damn. no one likes you when you're 23 without a plan damn. sit around an apartment saw they smoking weed and i'm like bitch don't care my vibe here at Banana Headquarters, we came up with an idea of taking a few concepts with physics and incorporating them into our own app. Concepts such as gravity, acceleration, friction, magnetic fields, and a few other others that apps use in order to give user a better experience. Our app consists on how friction and tension are used in something like app animations or acceleration to detect the phone movement. Gravity, which is uh, also used for screen for detecting screen orientation, or most specifically in things like racing games, and also magnetic field, which is commonly used for compass apps and mapping. Yeah. Yeah. All right, sort of. The demonstration being shown shows how friction and tension can affect certain animations when creating an app. We had to create a live physics environment in order to achieve this natural spring effect happening to the box. Certain apps such as Angry Birds, Amazing Thief, and Mega Jump all use tensions and frictions in their animation to make them appealing to the eye. going to go into the animation category and we're going to use the phone sensor to measure acceleration we're going to look in the left to right so I'm going to shake the phone left to right to get it accelerating on the x-axis then we're going to accelerate the phone on the y-axis by moving it up and down and then once again we're going to accelerate by pushing and pulling the phone now as you can see that gravity by holding the phone this way gravity is affecting the y-axis by making it around 9.8 and we're going to move the phone to affect the z-axis and by clicking the calculate I could calculate how many shakes I did. Our app here is taking full advantage of the phone's magnetic field sensor. Here we are demonstrating how this technology can be used in order to accomplish a basic compass. The sensor measures the geomagnetic field strength along the X, Y, and Z axis in micro -tessa. This helps developers such as ourselves when creating certain apps like GPS navigation. Uh, thank you for watching the West Team Banana Physics app. If you want a copy of the application, you can find us right there in the background of the class. Thank you for watching. Wait, what one are you going to stay in the next one? Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah man. You, you, so you guys are just going to stay in here? I'm just going to talk about that? Yeah. yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 Representing Team Banana all the way.